Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Okay, today I would like to present our project ENT 335 System Design IDP 1 Semester 2 2020-2031. Our project theme is Accessibility and Mobility of People with Disabilities and our title is A Smart Working Stick for Elderly People. Okay, first of all, our mentor is Technologist Dr. Anas Abdul Rahman. And we have four group member, me, Muhammad Syakur bin Muhammad Sabri, Muhammad Pidus bin Azman, Nurotul Aisyah bin Muhammad Azhar, and Nur Syuhada binti Ahmad Parik. Okay, next I will continue about introduction. Okay, first of all, some of people have physical difficulties such as elderly people have significant barrier to mobility which can prevent them from performing their daily life or activity. Okay, we can see. Why I highlight problem because, okay, back to our first point, I have mentioned elderly people. Okay. Most of them, when they reach their age above to 65 years old, they will face some problem of muscle weakness and loss of body balance. So that these people heavily depend on their family or other people to participate in a social activities. To face this problem, a smart working stick has been designed as an aid tool that can help to overcome their problem and provide some advanced information technology. Okay, as we know, nowadays, there is a lot of advanced information technology and advanced manufacturing technology and we can use this kind of technology to produce a new design with more safer and more comfortable. Okay. In addition, this working stick will be a device that can improve accessibility and mobility that can be linked with the IR 4.0 and Sustainable Development Goals. Okay, what is uh, IR 4.0? Okay, Industry 4.0 is a name or can be defined as a name for the current trade of automation and data exchange in manufacturing technology including cyber physical system, IoT, Internet of Things, cloud computing, and cognitive computing and creating. Okay, later I will discuss a little bit what we use in uh, IR 4.0. Okay, next is what is Sustainable Development Goal? Okay, as we know, there is a 17 SDG or Sustainable Development Goal and in this project, we can achieve the goal number nine, where is to develop uh, quality, reliable, sustainable, and resilient infrastructure to support human being focusing on affordable and equitable. Okay. Lastly, okay, related to IR 4.0, there is a two electronic part that we can use in this project. Okay, first of all, GPS, Global Position System, where can detect the location of user when they have some incident. And second one is sensor, where can be a security alarm. Background of Recess According to the report of the World Health Organization, WHO, Almost 28 until 35% of the elderly at 65 years old and older falls every year. Then, from the report, this number increased to 32 until 42% among the people over 70 years of age. In addition, injuries caused by falling have become the dominant reason for pain, disability, loose of cell carrying ability, and even premature die. For your information, the walking stick is just an important device to assist the elderly in walking and strolling. So, this is some example of walking stick or can. They are already on the market. However, this stick still has central drawback and weakness. So, we purpose and plan to develop a smart walking stick 
that had different features which are not present on a convenient stick. For my part, I will explain to you about the problem statements of our project. The working cane is supposed to be used by elderly people to help them working from one place to another place better. So, issues such as when the users have emergency from falling and have to call others for help from the people surrounding them is a common. So, in our project, we want to make it easier for the elderly people to call for help. And the second one is the current working canes are not stable for elderly people to use it. This is because most of the elderly people are always wobbling while they are working. And the third one is most of the elderly people cannot stand up easily from their seats. They have to get something to hold to support them to get up from their seats. This is whether there are someone help them or they hold to something to get up. And next, the current working canes do not have features such as to detect the user locations. This is important to, de to detect the user's location if something bad happened to them. And finally, most of the current working canes do not have embedded innovation in the working canes. The elderly people also want to use it. So the elderly people also want to use the new technology in their daily use product. Hence, uh, my team are so e eager to come up with a new product to cater and address these issues. For this project, we have three main objectives that we want to achieve. Firstly, designing and embedding new innovation into the existing walking stick design in the market. We identify that the walking stick in the market is still have not enough features and function in order to help elderly people to improve their daily life. Moreover, the market is not currently investing enough on innovation for the elderly people and there are a few walking stick in the market which are not appropriate to the needs of elderly people. Second objective, by adding the global position system or GPS and sensor to detect the location of elderly people. The function of GPS is to monitor the elderly users. For example, if they lost in unfamiliar neighborhood, especially for them who have Alzheimer or in a serious medical reason, so that their children can find out where they are and plus can track them for every minute of every day. And the purpose of sensor is work as an autofall alarm which can give strong alarm sound in case of a sudden fall so it can attract people surrounding them to help them before worse injuries happen. And the last objective is designing a smart working stick with seat and neighbor to strengthen the quality of life for elderly people. A working stick that combined with seat which can be opened to provide a seat when necessary and offers comfortable seating instantaneously. The NIBA function in our project is to help elderly people to provide extra support so they can stand up and sit down on a chair or couch without asking for help. For this part, I will explain to you about the scope of our project. Firstly, the targeted people for our project is for elderly people that have difficulties working with the conventional sticks. This is because majority of the working can users come from the elderly people that have difficulties to work because of their age and other medical conditions. Next, we want to employ technology based on the Internet of Things IoT, such as global positioning system GPS to detect the location of the users if something bad happened to them and uh, if they have some emergency and to address the IR 4.0 in our product 
and to achieve at least one of the 16 Sustainable Development Goals SDG. And finally, we want to focus to make a walking stick with a seat and knee bar with high durability to support their weight while sitting, standing up and walking. We want to add the seats because uh, the elderly people can rest a bit be before they continue their walk to the destination and we want to make add a knee bar because uh, to make it easier for them to stand up from their seats easily because without the help from others and we want to make a stable walking cane so that elderly people that use our walking canes can walk with stable from this table, benchmarking was conducted with four different walking sticks that were available in the market. The first product is the foldable walking stick. This walking stick is easy to handle and it will unfold quickly and slot together that make it always handy whenever users need it. Not just that, it's also very sturdy and lightweight to support users when walking and hiking. The second product is the foldable crotch cane walking stick seat stool chair square. This product comes with no sweat comfort grip that keep it from slipping as user wander the past and navigate indoors or outdoor. Besides that, it's also combined cane and stools that offer three sturdy legs for stability and just need minimal space to store. Next, the stainless steel walking stick quad cane, which is the most commonly used by elderly people all around the world. The height can be adjustable and the quad cane can add more stability to the user. But this product does not have features like others walking stick. The last product is the intelligent electronic walking stick walker aluminium alloy t-shirt handle. This product is complete with light emitting diode or LED lighting. Alarm, radio, auto fall alarm, and frosted non slip handle. It's also very easy and convenient to carry around and has a rotatable head which gives an extra wide base for extra support. With intelligent electronic walking stick worker aluminium alloy T straight handles, users can go anywhere and everywhere without having any insecurities. Okay, I will continue the last section which is transmission. Okay, first, a smart walking stick has to be designed with new technology to counter the problem faced by elderly people. And with this system, elderly people will be able to move from one place to another place independently. Second, this integrated design project IDP will act as a platform for us to improve the user amenity and their safety while using the walking stick. Third, designing a smart walking stick that consists of a seat and knee bar will reduce pain and weakness. Fourth, in this system, the sensor and GPS global position system will play as an important key role to detect the elderly people when in trouble. But from the features that have been improved, this new design of walking stick could be a device for elderly people to walk by themselves. As a summary, means the system can solve the problem that faced by elderly people in their daily life, and ultimately, this could increase the confidence level of the user as well as make him or her feel secure. I think that's all from us. Thank you for lending your ears. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.